Hello everyone and welcome back to my channel. So today, I'm sorry, my arm itches. <laughs> We're going to be doing a grooming box tour. So um, I actually need a new grooming box uh, or bag, grooming totes, because I do have a lot of stuff in here, but we're just going to have to get started. Okay, so this is my grooming bag. There's a lot of stuff in it. Um, I'm going to start with the inside. Um, so, first thing is I have this empty spray bottle. I put fly spray in it, I, um, whatever, detangler, anything liquid will go in here. So I just have this with me just in case. And then I have my soft brush, which is my absolute favorite soft brush. It is bendy, so it will bend with your hand. And all my brushes are extremely dirty. I gotta wash them. I'm so sorry for that. <laughs> okay. And then I have this brush with a sponge in the middle, so you can bathe the horse with it. So yeah, and you will see a lot of green stuff, because when I first got these, this grooming supplies, um... I was like, ooh, I want all green, but some of the brushes I couldn't find all green, so that's why some of them are blue or whatever. And then next, I have my green jelly scrubber. I've started to put my name on everything because people like to steal my stuff. My stuff. Only my stuff. So that's what that is. And then next, I have some leather cleaner, which is the soaps one it's the golden mink oil and it has a lot of hair on it because of the oil it's stuck together um and then i have my maiden's tail detangler these these products are absolutely my favorite i love them so much um so yeah and then next i have my sweat scraper it is in green uh, it's by tough one so yeah, I'm trying to get through this really fast because I have a lot of stuff. And then I have white rubber bands because all the horses I ride have pretty much white manes. So yeah, and then next I have a metal curry comb or shed shutter or whatever y'all want to call it. So yeah, and then the last thing in the middle is I have the liquid saddle or leather cleaner, which I love this the most. This is the best. I don't really like the soap, but they both work pretty well. Okay, then on the outside we have my um, Tail Tamer's main comb, and there's a pair in it. So, yeah, that's that. And then next I have my green hoof pick, um, which is, I don't really use this hoof pick that much. I have a lot of hoof picks, so let's just say that. I have like three of them. So, yeah. And then next I have my hard brush, which is in blue because I couldn't find one in green, which this is my newer hard brush because I didn't have a hard brush, but now I do. And then, and then next I have my um, other green hoof pick, which without the brush, and then I have a sponge that me and my friend cut in half because I forgot one but she was nice enough to give me or let me borrow half of her sponge which is really nice of her and go subscribe to her channel which is will be linked down below um, it's called equine how but I would definitely put the link down below um, so the next I have a little curry comb I really need to get a bigger curry comb which that's why I use my metal curry comb a lot because this really does not fit my hand and it's just too small so that's that and I just realized there's a lot of holes in this bag but whatever um and then next I have I have this um little brick thing um it's called like sleek and something um but it gets all the hair off whenever they're like shedding and stuff um I'm not really a big fan of this. It really doesn't work that well, but I just have it just to have it. I need to really grind it down. So you gotta keep it sharp on the edges, which obviously that's not how mine is right now. What you gotta do is rub on concrete and it'll sharpen it up. Then next I have one of those um, little 
um, clippers type things for the muzzle that I keep in here, which actually works really well, by the way, if your horse is scared of clippers for some reason. Um, and then I have, I'm just going to show this at the same time because I have two of them. I have two face brushes. Um, one's green, one's the goat hair one, which is like really soft, so I like to use this one the most. And my dog attacked them, so that's why I not only am ever going to sell these because of that. Um, and then I have my pooling comb. So, yeah. And then, lastly, in my green box, I have my other sock brush. So, I have a lot of brushes. Um, so yeah, that's that. So thank you for watching my grooming box tour. So there's a little overview. This bag really does fit a lot of stuff in it. Um, so yeah, uh, I'll link down, I'll link my friend's YouTube down below. So go check her out. She might need some subscribers. Um, uh, and definitely subscribe to this channel as well. Um, I will definitely, I could, I can hopefully start riding again in two weeks, so there will be more barn vlogs that are not as boring. Like I said in my last video, it's, I don't really, can I can't really do anything at the barn because I can't ride. I'm just like watching my friend ride or something like that. So, I really can't do that much. Um, but yeah, in a few weeks, I will definitely have barn vlogs up. Um, and yeah, so thanks for watching. Bye.